Method Mondays where I go over every single array method there is in JavaScript. And next up on our list for today, we're taking a look at sum. So let's just hop right into our editor and get right into it. So first up, let's use sum to check numbers in an array. Let's say we have const numbers here, just an array of numbers. And we'll store this all in a variable. We'll just call it has even, which is going to be assigned to our numbers array. But we're going to hit numbers with our sum method. Sum comes with a baked in callback function. So let's just build that out. And we're working with numbers here, so plural. So we'll just call this num. So take our numbers array. Array. We're gonna hit it with sum and for each num do something. So let's just take num and we're gonna use a mathematical operator here called the modulo, which is similar to division, but all this does is it's going to take num and divide it by something, whatever we give it, and then it just returns us the remainder. So that's all this does, it just gives us the remainder. So we'll take num modulo by two. If that equals zero, then just return this statement. So if whatever num is divided by two, if its remainder is zero, zero, then that will obviously result as true because then that will show that we have a even number in our array. So let's log has even to the console and we get true because we've got 12 and 18 in here. Those are even numbers. If divided by two, they're going to be left over with a remainder of zero. So sum will evaluate to true because remember, if at least one element meets the condition, it's going to be true. Otherwise it's false. 